I'm Jonathan Haskell. I've been at Imperial for eight years. I'm a professor of economics here, and I teach economics on the full-time MBA program and then on our MSc programs as well. I'm very lucky to have a career as a research academic. It gives me the time to think about some of the problems that, uh, that are facing the world and then hopefully bring some of those research thoughts and uh, hopefully some innovative thinking to the classroom to help the students as well. Imperial is a terrific mix of both uh, economics and business, uh, but also science. So for somebody like me who's interested in the knowledge economy and interested in science policy, uh, it's a terrific atmosphere to be in. I have two broad areas of speciality. One is I look at the economics of competition policy. Do markets work well? Are monopolies getting in the way? And the other is I look at intangible assets. I look at the way that firms build knowledge assets and what the implications are for growth and innovation in the economy as a whole. At the moment, I'm writing a book on intangible assets, which is an attempt to explain and understand uh, the implications for the fact that the economy has moved away from an economy where we're mostly producing tangible things, such as planes and cars and machines and all of that, to intangible things like this movie or software. What are the implications for the economy and what are the implications for society? Imperial set out a number of key aims about where it wants its research to go, uh, discovering more of the universe, for example, and that's a very exciting prospect. I guess my main hobby is I like cycling, uh, and in particular I'm very lucky that Imperial is right by Hyde Park, so when I cycle to work in the mornings, I cycle through Hyde Park, along the cycle paths, uh, and so I can arrive having had a good bit of exercise, uh, and hopefully that makes me into a better teacher and a better researcher for the rest of the day.